Hi everyone, today we're going to be talking about grey outfits. What happened there? I've gone all grey! It's a very grey day, probably while I'm wearing grey. But a lot of people commented about me wearing uh, a grey dress a while ago, which was this, I think. And uh, I've had a thought while I've been out, and I thought, let me show you a few of my grey selections. Follow me. bit drier in here it's just starting to rain out there which isn't very nice and it's that light mizzle which does nothing for my hair and of course it's quieter because next door seem to have got some workmen doing something anyway I'm in in the dry which is the uh, better so the dress yes the grey dress oops oh. <coughs> take that off I'll re reattach my mic, battery pack, that's why I wear the belt, there we go. So yeah, lots of, lots of people um, commented on this dress, but it was only a fleeting, fleeting of me wearing it at the beginning of, of one of my videos recently, but people who have commented on it, so I thought, while I've got it on, while I was out and about, I thought, let's do, do a quick... Uh, well, not a quick, these are never quick, are they? Uh, video of um, different aspects of grey. So yes, the grey dress, sleeveless, which is <sighs> got actually quite a few sleeveless, sleeveless dresses, um, but because I've got broad shoulders, um, that, well, it, my shoulder, I've been told I've got broad shoulders, <laughs> but because I've got broad shoulders, it, the dresses work better on me and they look nice so a little bit of a V as well just to help out but while I have been out what I've noticed with my grey boots which I haven't worn for a while I must admit and I'll come up to the shoe camera the low one and you'll probably notice that while I'm standing here it's all starting to flake and they've even more flaking coming off yeah they've broken down as you can see here and there while I've just been wearing them and I've only worn them for about half an hour um, while I was out so yes they're breaking down so um, I need another pair of grey boots which are very difficult to actually find because these are um, well as you can tell by the coat and which I was just wearing there are many different greys and this this is more of a, a greeny grey where my dress is a silver grey, belt black. So, but um, so yeah, I need to uh, look out for. Or if anyone would like to put, buy me a pair of boots, I wouldn't say no. <laughs> but, but yes, it's uh, these. Boots, I can't believe how much they've they flaked so much at the back. It's like a little um, I don't know little extra detail to them <laughs> so yeah um i've got a uh, few outfits um which uh, all dresses um but they are all different style different colors of gray and so what i wanted to do was just show you um what i do to um create different styles with the gray looks so uh let me take this with me and i'll probably leave a, a trail of uh, debris from these from these boots I must admit that's what what happens when you buy cheap boots because these were only about 30 pounds so yeah they do break down and do this so let me go and uh, sort myself out
just got to show you when I was taking these boots off, these are amazingly, oh, can't believe how bad the, these have gone. I don't know if the camera, look, I can actually just peel, peel it coming off. I've had boots flake before and it's usually just been around the toe where you bend it. And yes, it is flaking here, but I've never had it this bad around everywhere. Amazing. Anyway, too much, look, well, you can see the amount of mess it's made on the floor, but let me just, lose that back in there. Yeah, it's made even more mess in there. So, my outfit, it's smart casual, um, but more the upper range of smart. Wear it to the office, wear it um, for a, a night out somewhere, uh, meeting friends. Um, bit of colour with the handbag, so let me just pop that one down. It's a more expensive material, and it's actually a two layer material. If I just bend down and just, oh, <laughs> I can do this. There we are, it's actually two layer. So it actually hides, or it's, um, it, it's less forgiving, or more forgiving, sorry, not less forgiving, more forgiving uh, with lumps and bumps. So with uh, the lingerie or hosiery um, or underwear that you would wear, then um, yes, I could wear stockings with it, but personally, I think uh, hold-ups would work. So, the, so yes, it does hide the lumps and bumps on here. Um, again, I said about the my broad shoulders. Now, um, let me let me explain a bit more. Take the jacket off, which you've seen before. Let me just pop that there. So, with the with my broad shoulders. To, with my figure, if I turn around, excuse the backpack, mic pack, but with my figure, I am broader here and in proportion with the rest of my body, I think it's rather good. Now, with uh, it, it, work, it is proportional with my body. Now, yes, I've got my nippy any waist, which again, I've emphasised with a belt. And then, of course, I've got my, my larger hips. But it gives me, or people would say, I am a, an hourglass figure um, because of how I curve in like that. Um, I've still got a few more extra curves than I would like. <laughs> so uh, for me, it's uh, just trying to hide. So not hide, but move your eye from other other areas. So the belt does that. It's one which I can change, so I can actually make it more of a a drop weight, a uh, drop belt, as I have spoken about in other other videos. So yeah, bit of sparkle, and then I've got the hosiery on, and then the the shoes, classic pair of court shoes with the. Uh, platform as well. So oh, nice, nice classic outfit, which is a bit more sophisticated. And of course, I've changed my necklace as well, um, just for a bit of difference. But all, all my jewellery would be uh, silver, with all of the greys. Gold doesn't, I don't think, goes well with grey. So <sighs> let me change up again. This dress, very similar length compared to the first dress that I wore and everyone's commented on. Um, however, it's the same material as uh, the second dress I, I wore, which is the double layer, I won't show you. So it's a bit more classic, posh, formal, if, if you wish. But of course, it's a shorter length. And for me, the length is, um, for my modesty, this is as short as I would really want to get. Okay, um, however, let me take my jacket off. Yes, it's long sleeve, this one, instead of short. short. But with this, um, it's got, same with the uh, other skirts I wear, with the um, fit, the material which is elastic, um, it, it then always wants to go to the smallest part of your body, which is, of course, my waist. So, um, uh, and that's the same with a lot of, 
lot of um, girls who um, wear skirt or dresses this length in the material, this type of material, it is that the, every, you might see them walking down the road and they're going like this, pulling it all down because everything wants to ride. And that's very similar to what mine does because it wants to go to the smallest part of my weight, uh, my body, which is of course my waist. So for me, I don't wear a lot of elastic or stretchy stuff because of course it, well I do, but it, I have to be careful. I need to uh, hide my modesty. And, and so yes, it comes in, it pulls up to the smallest part of the waist. Hello, madam. Oh, you're wet. Been outside. Yes! Sniff, happy, content. Yeah, you're going to have a look at all of those bits on the floor now, aren't you? Anyway, so yes, um, but everything's a bit dark and grey. So just to liven this, this outfit up and make it a bit more fun, Let's bring a bit of colour in and it will make all the difference. So, pop that there. So take a belt off. Now you can see the difference of how the outfit looks without a belt. And then just by popping the belt on, defines it. Oh, defines my waist anyway. Pop that there. Now, let's do this properly. There's that. So, pop those over there. See, I'm conscious of the I'm conscious I'm pulling, my <laughs> pulling it down. <laughs> so yes, walk about and it does ride. So, here we are. Makes this oh, more fun. Oh, So, with the red shoes, red jacket, red belt, and the grey. Just livens things up a bit. Okay, the, uh, the grey long sleeves are probably take those down a bit but yeah I'm rather nice rather fun and of course it's one of one of my other favorite colors the red uh, right oh she's having a lick of tidying herself up from getting wet out there let's take all of this with me and then I can looking at <laughs> Ooh. so yeah difference with the there we go so this is definitely that was a office outfit this is more posh outfit so yes let's do the last outfit to say hello again oh you really are <laughs> getting wetter and wetter you've been out again <laughs> yes I know beautiful beautiful girl yes <laughs> you are I know I think you've seen all of my grey outfits now I don't think I've got anything left but of course my last one is my party outfit um, it's uh, what I call going out. Yes, yes, I would wear, um, I could wear it going to the shops, but probably get a few strange looks. But it's uh, definitely a going out. I'll show you the back as well. Um, it's got, um, compared to uh, the other dresses, which have got the dual layer, this dress has got um, a lining to it. So it, 
you've got this um, aspect of you see the lining unfortunately underneath um, even though you can it won't pull down longer but the top layer does ride and of course everyone every woman you've seen they always stand up and pull their dresses down but it, it was a um, from a, a brand of shop which I really did like actually but unfortunately they've they're no longer in business uh, but it's a uh, it's feels nice the waterfall effect on the top is is good but you have to be careful if I come closer to this camera even though I've got the mic there you see that the material uh, got a nice shine to it but if in certain areas especially where the mic is you'll possibly see let me get a bit closer maybe that you're getting the un how it falls you're getting the under part show which is that gray so it's it's just trial and error with the with the waterfall effect but it it's nice the back looks nice and you've got a bit of a detail there as well now with this outfit is as it's a party outfit then it's strappy sandals to wear so that's what I've put on at the moment and um, of course any strappy sandals they will they'll fit as long as you know you you've got them right to the back there and your foot's round so strap them on and you know they're going to be all right usually warm for going out or weddings but of course you're wearing them for a long time and you're on your feet all day and of course dancing around in them your feet do swell so uh, the straps then possibly might dig in and your feet get um, your, your foot will kind of dive shoe shoe drive or what, what's it called um, submarine so your feet will submarine in them um, so you've got to get them fitting correctly but they're they're a nice fit. These ones are quite nice actually because they've got the buckle around the side and I've got that extra bit here. So my foot is very well firmly in the shoe. So yeah, they're actually very nice. I think, I can't remember. No, can't see, can't see. I think it's a name brand, but yeah, they were, they were rather nice and they're, they're quite comfortable to wear for an amount of time. So there we are. Um, but otherwise, that's, that's it. Uh, on this grey day, you've seen all my grey outfits. <laughs> but I've definitely got to uh, do a bit of tidying up. And with uh, the vacuum at some point uh, soon. Because I've got so much mess from, from those boots. Anyway, but that's what I now need to do. So I will see you next time. Take care.